This is Miss V and Mr. V. Nah, I'm just kidding. This is my husband, Eric. Y'all have seen him in videos. I just wanted to formally introduce you to him. Introduce him to you all. This is Eric Smith. Of course, I'm Veronica Smith. And we want to wish y'all a Merry Christmas. But as you seen from the um, thumbnail, I'm going to be trying eggnog for the first time. I promised him I would try it, so I said, I'm going to go ahead and do a uh, video. And I'm not... Um, enthused about trying it, but I am going to go ahead and try it. If y'all have ever tried eggnog, let me know how y'all liked it. But here we go. I'm going to let him go ahead and pour it. I want but half a cup, baby. But anyway, Merry Christmas. I hope everybody's having a good Christmas. Y'all remember the reason for the season. It is the birth of Jesus. And I don't know how we got caught up in the buying all these Christmas presents for everybody. If, if we celebrate Jesus' birthday... Why I got to buy you a present? I don't understand. But anyway, my kids are grown, so I stopped doing all that. I was one of the parents who used to make payment arrangements and all that good stuff to get my kids the things they want. I have been guilty of that. But now that I'm closer to God and I understand the reasoning for it, I'm not doing all that. Because most of the kids don't appreciate it. If you got 30 gifts um, strolled on the floor, you ain't going to appreciate nothing. You ain't going to appreciate all them gifts. So... I work too hard for my money, and I'm changing, so I'm doing things that are more um, practical as far as gift giving. So uh, I'm going to give you things that you really will use because I work too hard for my money. Okay, enough of that rant. I'm going to go ahead and try this eggnog. Um, I guess he ain't going to give me one. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Y'all see it. Man. Cheers. To, to Jesus. To Jesus, exactly. Go ahead, baby. Start I'm trying to stall, y'all. <laughs> she doesn't know what she's missing, everybody. This is some good stuff. <laughs> and she's a beautiful woman, but never tried eggnog. I've never, when I first met her, I didn't know her. Until I know, got to know her now. She's beautiful. She's everything I want in a woman. It's just going to be just like an eggnog. You don't know what you're getting until you find a taste. So now... With all that being said and done, do the honor, sweet cheeks. Well, he, everybody, I'm going to give her a demonstration of what it's really like. I'm going to taste it. How are you going to give me a demonstration in, of when what it's really like? Her reaction, she'll love it. How are you going to give us a demonstration? He got his table and I got mine. He done made the video about him loving me. Ding. Hmm. Hmm. You already perking up. Okay, here we go. You didn't taste enough of it. She didn't taste enough of I it. I did taste enough. It's okay. I mean, it tastes like um, melted ice cream. It's not bad. So why do people put alcohol in it? I don't understand that part. To get the tang of it. It's, it's a ho This is a holiday drink. It's the neutral holiday drink, but when you put the little alcohol in it, it perks up the holiday for them. Because they just want to add some alcohol. This is for folks who like to drink. Just, I don't even see the purpose of adding no alcohol to no ice cream. What you want? To, you want say, your stomach to be tore up? <laughs> let's just say um, they're put, taking the innocence out of the uh, holidays with the eggnog and putting a little vodka. Leave in it up to man and mess up everything. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and drink the rest of this, but this ain't one of them drinks I'm going to be like, baby, let's stop and give me some eggnog. So I'm going to finish it. It's all right. You can tell it's a once a year thing, so anyway. After after Christmas, you won't see no more of this till next year. So y'all seen, I don't know half of people talking about, but anyway, I appreciate him being here. <laughs> Unconditional love, baby. Y'all thank thank you for uh <laughs> thank y'all for tuning in and have a Merry Christmas and a prosperous new year. And see y'all in the next video. <laughs> well, well. Looks like y'all two in time out. Don't be getting mad, cause you both deserve it. If you do what you're supposed to do, you wouldn't have to be in timeout, now would you? So you just stay up there and look beautiful, handsome, and you just stay right there and look beautiful, Mrs. V. Mr. and Mrs. V, enjoy your timeout.
Wait a minute. Something's not right here. I thought I had y'all more separated than that, than this. Y'all still look like y'all extremely close to each other. Mr. V, correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't I have you uh, sitting up on this section first? And you, Mrs. V, didn't I have you down lower to right here for a minute? What's going on here? Are y'all trying to pull a fast one on me? Oh, wait a minute now. Both of y'all sitting together, Mr. and Mrs. V. Now, I was born at night, but not last night. I had both of you separated not too long ago. Mrs. V, I had you way down here at the bottom. And Mr. V, I had you way up here at the top. Now, y'all both of you sitting together. You naughty bad little things, you. I'm going to have to just rearrange y'all back again, huh? What am I going to do with you two? Hard-headed.